Also now at 530, the dive boat tragedy raising concerns about passenger safety. And now a closer look at safety inspections. Good evening, I'm Alan Martin. And I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. KPX 5's Don Ford is in the Emeryville Harbor with the important features charter boats are required to have to avoid tragedy. When the Coast Guard does a safety inspection of a commercial passenger vessel, it is serious business. But what exactly are they looking for? If it floats on the bay and carries seven or more passengers for hire, you must have a certificate of inspection from the Coast Guard. Well, I yeah. go to the marinas here and I do safety compliance exams. Or Lieutenant Athena Stricker is a marine safety inspector specialist. You need her approval before leaving the dock with passengers. Safety component, the life saving. We're looking at the engine room to name a few. Uh, the fixed fire systems in place, those portable extinguishers. You're talking to the captain and crew, ensuring they know how to utilize the equipment on board. The charter fishing vessel Pacific Pearl is in the harbor today for routine scheduled maintenance. It's a modern charter boat with state-of-the-art safety equipment. The Pearl is inspected every 12 months. So an annual inspection would be done by the Coast Guard with a handful of their officers. They'll inspect life vests, all of your life saving equipment, your fire system, uh, anything that has to do with keeping people safe. The Pearl has an automated fire suppression system in the engine room. This large fire extinguisher will douse the entire engine bay if triggered. Another system shuts the engines down. An emergency position indicating radio beacon, or EPIRP, is another automated system that transmits to satellites if the boat is in trouble. The life raft is inspected, and this one holds 20 people. Somebody is installing a new radar system today, too. And radar is part of the safety system, too. Absolutely. Coast Guard says most Bay Area charter boats are well equipped and pass the inspections without issues. In Emeryville, Don Ford, KPIX 5.